Buckeye head football coach Jerome Sowers becoming the next head football coach of the MSU Northern Lights last Friday, the move has been seen as surprising as Sowers will inherit a program that went 3-34 in the last four seasons. Sowers comes to Haver with quite the pedigree. He was the defensive coordinator of Montana when the Grizzlies won a national title in 1995 and became the winningest head coach in Big Sky Conference history over 18 seasons at Northern Arizona. Most people would see the move to MSU Northern as a step down. Coach Sowers doesn't. When you're helping young people, it's not a step down, it's a step up. And this is an opportunity to step up and help young people. I don't care where they're from, I don't care where they're at, we're here to help people. That's kind of an old school thought, but this is where, this is the way I was raised and this is what's always been rewarding to me. It's the intrinsic value of the experience itself. Nobody's getting rich here, but we're all getting rich in the relationships of others. However, moving to Haver was never part of his plan. Sowers most recently served as the defensive coordinator at Southern Oregon University, where he and his wife Tracy had plans to spend their days helping young athletes through coaching. But those plans changed after Tracy's sudden death in September of 2020. I could not stay in Ashland any longer. Uh, the memories were too difficult for me to deal with, so I, I ended up uh, moving to Portland. And, uh, and on the way there, you know, I got a call from Chancellor Keel about an opportunity that existed at Montana State University Northern. And uh, so I flew out last week to, to interview for the position. Despite the winding road that led Sowers to take over a struggling program in Haver, Sowers is back to the grindstone already, establishing a plan to improve the roster through a strong recruiting presence in the High Line and throughout the state. And so we're going to be teaching ABCs early before we create a word. When we create a word, we'll start building a sentence. Before we write this story, we have a lot of work to do. But the bottom line is this, what are we going to be? We're going to be a program that's going to start recruiting on the high line first. We want the western and east borders covered. And we're going to be there, I'm going to be there in a presence and recruiting. And, uh, and then building further south as we go and as we need to. Coach Sowers is still in the process of moving to Haver, but he's already expressed his excitement in the program, school, and community and what they're all about. Here in Haver, I'm Dylan Foreman, MTN Sports.